What is going on guys? So today I'm going to be going over some pictures that were either from movies or ads and they're supposed to like represent somebody who's in the military and let me tell you, I mean these people are screwing up all over the place. So I thought a fun little video topic idea would be to kind of go over some of these just terrible photos where anybody who's in the military is going to notice what's wrong with them like immediately. And so this will be a fun thing to do and hopefully with you guys watching this video, if you see these ads and things like that out there or even in movies, I'm not going to show any movie clips or anything, but even in movies, you can pick up on some of this stuff that's going to be um, in, in this video. And it's just like, oh my gosh, like why do these people keep doing it? Like it's really easy. Just ask somebody in the military, like as far as these advertisers goes, like just ask somebody in the military, hey, does this look right? Is this how it is in the military? I mean, I guess they don't do that. But without further ado, let's go ahead and jump into the first horrible picture. Now immediately there are quite a few things that I noticed about this picture. Number one, his t-shirt is not matching the actual uniform that he's actually wearing. It should be an actual lighter tan color. And now for ads and pictures and things like that, you might be like, oh, he's not wearing his name tapes. Well, technically in some pictures and things like that, ads, like they shouldn't really be showing their name tapes and things like that. So it shouldn't show their name, rank, or the unit that they're in or supposed to be representing or whatever, just for operational security purposes. But the big thing about this guy's uniform and that you're gonna see in pictures and videos and movies and stuff all over the place is I don't understand why people's collars are always just jacked up and they just have their collars popped. Like, that's not how we do that. Like, there's really like no circumstance unless it's super, 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 super cold that you're going to pop your collar and actually have it be like a turtleneck. And then another thing that's really obvious is he has facial hair in his uniform. Now, I have facial hair because I'm in the reserves and I'm not on duty and I'm not in uniform. If I'm ever in uniform, you have to shave. I don't know how that slipped this person's mind. It's not that they have a shaving profile, it's because he's obviously shaving, but that's just that's just ridiculous. And then on top of it all, face paint is terrible and then where is his cover for his for his ACH? Like where is it at? That was that was a doozy. So there's a lot of stuff going on wrong in that just seemingly simple picture and then here we go again pop collar i don't know why people do this like why like you don't see it you don't see people doing it in the actual military like your collar is not going to look like that he even has the flap he even has like there's a in the old acu one they don't have it in the current ocp style acu uniform but there used to be like a little flap that you could go whenever you do pop the collar and you can kind of wrap it around and people used to put ranks and stuff underneath or whatever for their next promoted rank or whatever. But why is it undone? I mean, again, he doesn't have a rank on his PC and his PC is very flat. So they obviously just like got the PC from somewhere and they didn't actually bend the bill down. But I just hate ads like this. Like it's just such a simple thing and you're screwing it up. Now this is just simply stupid. I, this, is he saluting somebody over the laptop while he's holding it up and obviously a weird salute like why is he doing up here he should be doing it on his eyebrow so you want your pointer finger and your middle finger to be right at your eyebrow um why is his why does he have all that stuff on i mean he's obviously not in an environment where he needs to have elbow pads on and here we go again this is a theme of the video pop collar why in the world do we have a pop collar i don't even know what uniform this person is wearing but they have the american flag on their uniform to say that they're in the u.s military but it's on the wrong shoulder and by it being on the wrong shoulder technically the flag is facing the wrong direction like how do people not catch this now looking at this one pop collar same thing now, like I said, no name tapes or anything like that. That's kind of how it should be, but pop collar. Like, you know, he looks like he needs to be taped a little bit. Like he's probably not making the high weight requirements. So why are they using him for an ad of military? And then on top of it, popped collar. I think this one is from a movie or a TV show. I'm not actually sure what show it's from, but the guy on the right, his hairstyle is not in regs. It is not in rank, so it seems like it's a TV show, and I'm sorry if I don't know what it is, but 
yeah, that that's that's not gonna fly. Everything else looks kind of okay, but that hairstyle is not good. Okay, here we go. We got it looks like the TV show because I recognize at least one character there. Same guys in their uniforms. Oh, like what is the tank doing there on the street? Like what? And then number one, big uniform mistake. His dog collars or uh, dog tags, not dog collars. Dog tags are outside of his t-shirt they should be under your t-shirt you should not have your dog tags over your outermost clothing so technically if you are wearing the top and the t-shirt you can have it under the top but you should just pretty much always have it under your t-shirt hands are in pockets why is his hands in his pockets the female who's on the tank the, again the freaking tank her hair is not done properly the one guy's zipper is undone on his top like what in the world is going on i mean this is obviously like a tv show nobody is telling him that this looks stupid found another one with the same tv show guys um what are you doing like hands in pockets just the top is unzipped like and then they're just like reaching for each other's hair i don't know that's not technically outer regs but like the dude's hair is terrible and the ACU top is unzipped for some reason. Now this picture comes out of the movie War Machine, which I watched recently and it had a lot of little things and some uniform, uh, uniform mistakes and stuff and it was just like a little bit frustrating. Um, I read some reviews and they said some things were accurate or whatever but he portrayed them weird but like again, pop collar. You're gonna see it in movies ads all over the place i don't know why i don't know i don't know i really don't know why that they continue to do this and this guy just seems like he's rebelling against every uniform law or not law he's just rebelling against ucmj with not wearing any patches i don't think he has a rank on right there and a pop collar now this is one of those that some people might view um it looks like it's an ad for a hallmark channel TV show Meet My Mom or something. Now, some people might view this and be like, oh, there's there's not much wrong with it. You know, he is wearing his patches and stuff and it shows what rank he is in unit, but when you shift towards his head, where's the rank at on his PC? His patrol gram, all right? So if you're wearing your rank, so he looks like he's a sergeant first class, he has a rank right here, and he should have a rank on his PC, but it's gone for some weird reason. And then he also has what looks like aviator glasses, which uh, are not in regs. You can't wear those. Technically, you're supposed to be wearing sunglasses that are just basically all blacked out, that don't have any kind of insignia um, or like um, branding and stuff on it. Usually, people get by with Oakleys if a, with a dark um with a dark logo i guess on it so you don't want like any weird colors or anything and aviators are not good some people do get away with it but the big thing here it i mean they did okay until it came to the rank on the pc see now this one they just did it for me right so this is from a movie obviously you guys probably seen it before but in this picture it is just laying it out for you so like again if you're in the military you do notice things in movies and pictures and stuff and you're like that's that's not quite right or that's not really how it should be or that uniform looks terrible this is kind of doing a little deeper dive right so we got a wrong camouflage pattern for the year the movie was set i watched the movie the other day and the uniforms were just like i'm like why the freak are they wearing those uniforms when it's in this time area so that happens in movies sometimes they're just wearing the wrong uniform and then fingerless gloves are not permitted so that's also true army doesn't allow rolled up sleeves the army allows rolled up sleeves now but i think at the time that this is portraying they didn't um and then the camouflage pattern doesn't match the uniform so the headgear and his actual you know top of the uniform technically that could be okay so i'm gonna give it a pass on this movie because like if you look at people in the military now we have the old uniform pattern which people refer to as the acu and then we have the ocp uniform which is technically the new acu uniform and they're mismatch they're mismatches like the little digital and the brown and green uniform and the reason that it's mismatched and it happens every time that the military switches uniforms is just because 
They don't just push everything out all at once. It takes time. So, um, and, and no eye protection. Yeah, he, he would definitely be wearing some eye pro. So I'm gonna close off this video with this picture right here. And it's just, what? I mean, the only thing he's doing correctly, he's not even holding his weapon correctly. The only thing he's doing correctly is he's clean shaped. And he has a, uni a head, or he has hair that are possibly in regs. I mean, just, just look at the flag on his right shoulder. And like, there are so many things wrong with this picture. Um, that I would have to take a whole video to just go into it and be like, why the freak is this guy doing this? So yeah, there are a lot of pictures and movies and things that people get wrong whenever it's referring or trying to represent the military. So this is just some of them, right? So a big thing that I just see everywhere is the pop collar. People have facial hair sometimes. People wear the uniform incorrectly. People wear uniforms that are in the wrong area. era. It's crazy, right? Um, I thought about doing maybe like a video, so showing clips of videos from uh, movies and things like that where they're just getting it wrong. Like, you know, this, this one movie, the commander is just going around and greeting people and he's greeting everybody by the wrong rank. I think that would be kind of fun. Um, to watch on video. So there's things like that that I could do in the future. If you guys want to see that, make sure you let me know down in the comment section down below. But that is it for this video. And all these crazy pictures, like it's just crazy. All these crazy pictures. So that's it, I hope you guys enjoyed it. If you did, hit that like button, that'd be awesome. If you just check out more of my videos, hit that subscribe button, that would be even better. And hit the notification bell button because that would really make my day. Pick up some of this merch, Pogue Lives Matter. I don't know if you can see it, Pogue Lives Matter matter because they really do so follow me on instagram and snapchat if you haven't already i hope you guys have an amazing freaking day and i'll see y'all later Drop.